Fitness. Today's workout is a kickboxing workout with strength intervals using kettlebells or dumbbells. I have two sets of kettlebells. One is 15 pounds, one is 10 pounds. So you need a set that is a bit higher and set that is a bit lower. Make sure you have water, towel, good music, good attitude, and let's get this workout on a row. We're gonna start with a warm up. Marching here on a spot, waking up all those muscles, waking up the body. And now take it up for a little jog. Loosen up the arms, loosen up the legs. And now stay here, take a nice deep breath in. And breathe out. Again, in. And out. One more time, deep breath in. And out, and arms forward, big circles with the arms, warming up those arms, warming up the shoulders. And I'll change direction. Try to keep your elbows straight. And I'll bring your elbows up at the shoulder level, turning your body, warming up through the middle back. Few more here. Come back in the center, circle your hips. So we're actually gonna start with strength interval followed by kickboxing interval. Change direction. Circle your foot, your ankle. Change direction. Change legs. Change direction. Bring your hands together, change direction. All right, give me 10 jumping jacks here for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hands up, 10 squats, down and up, keeping your shoulders back.
timer fell. <laughs> That's okay. A little bit more. Come on, speed it up, speed it up. All right, now we're going back to the swings. So if you want to challenge, use heavy weight. I'm going to use two kettlebells. All right, bend forward. Two. Open up the legs, here we go. So I do have a 20 pound kettlebell, but it's outside. So it's better for me to use the two here. And yes, this is more challenging. I'm feeling those. One minute here. Keep it going, keep it going. About halfway. You're looking good. Come on, let's go. Number two, we're going to do bend over rows. So we're going to do a single, single, and a double. Then we're going to do jab, cross, and kick. So now you need two kettlebells right from the start. Might as well start with the heavier ones. Woo. Okay, bend over, abs and tight, single, single. Double. When you do in the rows, don't tighten up your neck and shoulders. Think of your elbows reaching up to the sky. You want to squeeze the shoulder blades together. And the muscles that you're working are the muscles between your shoulder blades, your big back muscles. And you're gonna also feel in your biceps. And pull, kind of like carrying a big shopping bag and you're pulling it up. Single, single, and a double. Keep it going. Almost there. Three, two, one. Yes. Okay, time. Kettlebell down. Okay, now it's jab, cross, kick from the back leg. Left leg's in the front. Hands up. Three. Ready. Two, one. Just cross, kick. One, two, kick. One, two, kick. We're gonna go for the speed here. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. Kick. One, two. One, two. Only 30 seconds per side. Last one. one. Nice. Back to the kettlebells. Let me give you the other side view now. Catching your breath. Bend over. Two. One. Abs in touch. Single. Single. And double. Squeeze it. Pull it up. So, this workout combines two of my favorite workouts. Kettlebell and kickboxing. I love those, both of them. Working hard. Come on, let's go. All the way to the end. Three, 
ready? Guard stance, fighter stance. Three. Ready to go. One. One, two, two three. One, two, three. Keep it up, keep it up. Two, one, rest. Okay, now, hook, uppercut, hook, uppercut. Hands up, left leg in front. Three, two, one. Exercise two. Go. Hook, upper. One, two. One, two. Now we're going to speed it up.
come back right to it. But if you don't want to take a break, stay with me. Now we're doing plank position. You're gonna pass the kettlebell under your body. In between, we're gonna do a push up. And then we're gonna do some push kicks. Sounds nice, right? Okay. Ready, plank position. Exercise. Pass it, do a push up. Pass it back. And push up. And pass again.
you can keep your fin um, wrists in, in, or you can rotate them out. So when you keep them in, it's more ergonomically correct. It's easier on your shoulder joint. When you turn them out, it's a bit tougher on your shoulder joint. So if you have any shoulder issues, keep your wrists, your palms facing in, facing in one another. Keep it going, keep it going. And time. All right, bring it down. Okay, now we're gonna do alternate kicks. Hands up. So now we're doing snap kicks, alternating. Get yourself ready. Two, one, exercise two. Go. Kick, 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 kick. We're gonna add some uppercuts here. Go. Punch it up, punch it up. More variety, more fun. It goes by faster. Go, 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 back to kicks. Kick, point them forward, those toes. Keep it up, keep it up. Three. And again, uppercuts. One. Rest. Okay, back to kettlebells. One more set. Shoulder plant, single, single, double. So I did mine with my right arm, which is your left. Three. I'm going to start with my other arm now. Exercise three. Single, single, double. Push it up. Push it up. Shoulders are tough for me, so that's why I have to work a bit harder here. As women, we tend to have weak shoulders, so we must work on them. So we're stronger, we can carry groceries, carry children, carry heavy suitcases, whatever it is. We need to have strong shoulders. Plus, strong shoulders, toned shoulders, look nice in a tank top, right? And a bikini. So let's do it. To the shoulders. Woohoo! Keep it up. Three, two, one. And time. Okay, we're gonna start with uppercuts now. Get yourself ready, hands up. Moving your arms and legs at the same time. Three, two, one, go. Exercise four. Change it to kicks. Uppercuts. Kicks. Uppercuts. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Kicks.
legs, going in a jumping jacks position, and just punches to the front. Three, two, one. Okay, hands up. Go. Pure cardio. Only 30 seconds. Landing softly on the ball of the foot. Go, go. Keep it going, stay with it. Nice. All right, back down to the Russian twist. I'm gonna start with my other side now. If you can, bring your legs up. If you don't have any issues with your lower back. Two, press. One, two, press. I'm gonna challenge myself a bit, but if I feel my lower back, I'm gonna bring my legs down. So far, so good. Working on your core, it's so important to protect your lower back, to have strong core. Your core is your foundation to all the movements that you do every single day. Okay, I'm bringing my feet down. I'm feeling my lower back. But you can still feel this exercise with your legs down. And press. One, two, three. Last one. One. Yes. Okay, stand up. Last exercise of the day, star punches. You are a star, woohoo! Hands up. Two, one. And go. Come on, give it all you got now. You're almost done. If you've had many children like me, and if you feel like you need to go pee after jumping jacks, just, just take it to low impact. That's okay. I understand. One. Your timer is complete. Your timer is complete. Woohoo! Do a little stretch, cool down. Thank you so much for working out with me. Please like, share the video, subscribe to my channel. I will talk to you soon. Adios.